Hey everybody, welcome back to Jamea's promo. Today is March 23rd, and if you're watching this video, then more than likely you might be having some applications crashing. Majority of these are probably being done through either Amazon or especially Google. Now, yesterday this happened to me. I tried to open up Gmail several times. It would basically look like it wants to open, but it shuts down right away. Couldn't even read one email by the time that it's crashed. And there's been a lot of updates that was pushed out, but what was causing this issue? I fixed it last night. I was about to shoot a video, but it sounded like Google was trying to push out a fix for this even last night, right around 9 p.m., 10 p.m., but evidently there's still some people that's having issues. So if you're still having any type of problems, just go right inside of your settings. You're going to scroll down to where you see apps. Now inside of applications, at least here on Samsung One UI 3.1, I can actually search for really any application on my phone. Usually you would have to have the option to search for system apps. Uh, you also have even Samsung apps, things like that. But if you can look for system apps and really what you're gonna search for is gonna be one that is called Android System Web View. So if you can find Android System Web View, once you open this up, then what you're going to want to do is on the very top right hand side you can go to uninstall updates now once you uninstall the update now if you find that uninstalling that last update did not help just go back inside of your apps and again if you have to search for system applications look for system applications first and then you'll find android system web view the exact same application we just got done looking at now you can hit on disable and you'd be able to disable the application so this way you'd be able to test to see if this would also help now one thing i did notice is that on the top when I went through and I uninstalled it from the first time, what will happen is you won't really be able to find it here. So even if I search for it right now, trying to find that whole web view, you can see that there's nothing that pops up. Now, if I go back inside of the Play Store on the top left hand side, you'll notice that underneath my apps, if I was to search for an update, here is that Android system web view update. And this is really what kind of caused that issue. So again, I'm reinstalling it, getting it, getting it back onto my phone. Uh, and so if you notice that you uninstall the update and it maybe worked for maybe five to ten minutes and then you go back inside and you find that some of these apps are crashing one more time you can see here that I uninstalled the update but if your phone is set up to where you do automatic updates and this thing updates by itself uh, then you can see that it's sitting here one more time and then this is where you can go through and you can hit on disable now if you ever do need to turn this one back on you can still search for the the web view the Android system web view and then you can turn it right back on to see if it's working again Google was supposed to be pushing off an update for this that's why i didn't shoot a video last night about this because i figured the, the the fix would already be there i just got a text from my mom and she stated that she was having app crashes so that just kind of pushed me to shoot this video this morning for you guys in case if you're still running into this issue so if you guys like this video if it helped out and you appreciate it please give it a big thumbs up don't forget to hit subscribe subscribe right over here on the very bottom left hand side and if you like this video the more than likely you'll also like this video and i'll see you guys later oh yeah 69